You better look, you're on camera. <gasps> Say hi. Hi. Say hi. Yvera, this is important because this video is all about you. So we're so glad that you would join us, yeah. It's all about you. So Yvera was born in springtime. We love the spring. And today we basically just want to tell you guys so many of the things that we love about Yvera that she's learned in this past year. I think one of like the funnest things about being a parent is just getting to see your kid grow and learn. So one of the things that she does to get a reaction is she does this face. <laughs> <laughs> Again? So anyway, she screams a lot too. <laughs> she screams, she makes that face all the time and repetitively too. And sometimes mom tries and. No, it's okay, you bear. And then she does it again. I'm like worried that she's gonna pop a, pop a blood vessel or something. <laughs> One of my favorite things to do with her is the one, two, three game, where you say one, two, three, and do something, and she'll think it's funny, and then the second time you do it, she gets all nervous, like one, two, and she's like, oh, I can't believe this is happening. <laughs> one, two, three. <laughs> one, two, three. As you already know, Yvera loves dancing, and now we can even just say the word dance. And she almost starts dancing. She, you can see this little leg wobble that she does. <laughs> Should we dance? Yeah, dance. Should we dance? <laughs> yeah, little dances. She has a few other little tricks and little games that she likes to play with us. Okay, Yvera, let's show them good job. Good job! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay, yeah, we'll clap for that one. Can you high five? Oh, you got. Oh. <gasps> yeah! <laughs> Thank you. Can you high five? <laughs> yeah. So we're really excited to tell you about our week. Basically, Jessica has worked like crazy on our website, which you may or may not have seen, thesingermans.com. So if you haven't seen it, check it out. It's awesome. Funny thing that I did this week is I just got it in my head that I have all these split ends, and, but I didn't want to go pay for a haircut. And so I just decided that it probably wasn't that hard and I would just trim my own hair. And I've literally never done that before, so I don't know why I thought that would be a good idea. But I didn't do it too bad. It's all pretty good and even, but there is just like this one part right here that I cut too short. I've never tried to cut my own hair, but the evolution of my haircuts has been legendary. <laughs> I've gone from a total buzz cut, number two buzz, we're talking really fine when I was young because I loved being free and not having any hair to mess with. I've done longer hair, because I, as a drummer, I like to whip my hair around, <laughs> play drum. I had this face that I do that I make, just... And I got my long hair. The spiky hair, there's a time I remember for Easter, my mom got got to be glued hairspray, like super strength. And that's one of the things that the Easter Bunny brought me. And it's probably the big, biggest thing the Easter Bunny has ever brought me. <laughs> and I thought I was so cool. This thing looked like it was meant for like construction work. It was this yellow can and at the top it had this gray super nozzle. I swear, you know, like the nozzle was surrounded by plastic because it was just destructive. <laughs> and I could finally um, spike my hair and still have it be long like I wanted it to be. <laughs> So, and I didn't just spike the top, I spiked the sides. I mean, looking back, I really look like a porcupine. <laughs> I think that the cutest tie hairdo is like four-year-old tie. Then I had my mullet. Yeah. Just look how cute he is. So we hope that you guys are enjoying spring as much as we are and that you have a great week this week. <laughs> <laughs>
So all this time we've been wondering where does Iver get her little face from and I found the answer. I was going through some pictures trying to find some of, of Ty's hair. Okay, you just have to look.